All right, guys, it's Charlie Tango 1994 back with another YouTube video. It's a bit of a special video this time around because last week I got a message through my Facebook page from a young man called George who lives down in Devon. He had contacted me because he has a lot of CB radio equipment which he was looking to sell and had contacted me to see if I might be interested or knew anyone that might be interested in purchasing them. Now, when I say a lot of CB radio equipment, I mean a lot. In his message, he explained that his great-grandfather had recently passed away and this collection of CB radios, aerials and other accessories had belonged to him. His great-grandfather was famed in his part of the world as a renowned rig doctor and was well known in his area. In fact, people travelled great distances to have him look at their radios, so he clearly had a great reputation. George's grandfather was known as John William Cleverly but was known by his friends as William, and at the time of passing had over 700 radios in his possession. George explained that they had cleared out nearly 500 of William's old radios, and what was left was in great condition, and that many of them were still in their original boxes. In fact, the hall comes in at a staggering 195 radios, with microphones and countless antennas and other accessories. If you're new to this channel and would like to see more CB related videos, feel free to hit the subscribe button below and watch out for new videos uploaded every Wednesday. If you enjoy my videos, don't forget to hit the like button or leave me a note in the comments section. Also, if you're new to CB radio, watch this video through to the end to find out more about the free gift I offer to all of my subscribers. Sadly, I don't have the funds to be able to offer him a fair price and based on the quantity available, wouldn't have the space to store it all but I did offer to make a video on my channel and see if there was anyone else out there that might be interested in taking it off his hands so here we are now if there is someone out there who would be interested in purchasing the hall as a job lot then I've put a link to George's email down in the video description so you can get in touch with him direct I know there are a lot of dealers out there who might be interested in getting their hands on so many original items or perhaps someone who'd be interested in selling them separately on eBay or something there might even be a collector out there who would be interested in taking them off his hands. So as I say, you should reach out to him through the email address in the video description below. I did ask George to send me details of what they had on offer and he was kind enough to send me a video. It was only when I saw the video that I realised just how much gear there was. I don't have details of exactly what there is, but it clearly is a real treasure trove of CB radio and William really did have a veritable Aladdin's cave of stuff. Here's the video that George sent me, and as you can see, there is shelf upon shelf of stuff covering two huge racks of shelving, so there really is a lot of stuff there. I can't make out everything, but there are definitely a number of as new items, albeit that a lot of it would be over 30 years old. I've spotted a quantity of boxes, home base mics, scores and scores of antennas, and at least a number of radio amps, power meters and other bits like external speakers so this really is a great opportunity for the right buyer. Clearly, William had a real passion for this kind of thing and I'm only too happy to help his family put these items into the right hands. I've never met either George or William, but from what George tells me, he was well known to a lot of people, so it may be that you knew of him. I did want to take this opportunity to pass my condolences to William's family and friends and say how sorry I am to hear of their loss. William sounds like a person I would have got on with and I've no doubt he would have had a fair few stories about the heyday of CB radio. So, if you're interested in finding out more about this equipment, please drop George an email in the link below and make the necessary arrangements with him. Also, be aware that they are based down in Devon, so you may need to arrange transportation and collection from that beautiful part of the country if you do plan to purchase from them. I came across a bit of a meme recently which would seem pretty apt for this video, and in my eyes, would confirm that William is indeed a winner. All the best to you, George, and thanks for getting in touch. Hope you enjoyed watching this video, and as a thank you to you, particularly if you're new to CB Radio, or returning to it after many years, I've put together a free information series called The Beginner's Guide to CB Radio, which I'm sharing with all of my subscribers. To find out more, click the link in the top right corner now. And new for 2018, 
is my CB Radio playlist.